In the exercise 4.3, we will get to know the hierarchy in Power BI. Once again, we will see this on a map visual where we will create a hierarchy of data on the location shelf. Uh, we will use the country, then the next level is state, and the last level is the city. And once again, we will analyze the sales. Uh, to better understand what's happening on the whole dashboard, we will also create a card, which is uh, another visual that will just show us the current sales in the current filter context. And having this kind of two visualization is enough for us to start working with the hierarchy. Uh, the hierarchy icons can be found in the top right corner of the chart. And the best option to start working with the hierarchy is to turn on the drill down mode, which means you can now go to France, for example, and drill down into this country to have a look on the states where we sell our products we see some kind of uh, state of uh, France and then we can go even deeper just by left clicking and have a look what are the cities uh, where we sell all of this information. We can turn off also this drill down mode and just select a particular um, bubbles to have a look on the total sales for them. We go back by drilling up by using the up arrow and now we are looking once again on the whole euro the second way to work with the hierarchy on a map like this is to use the expand icon to go down to the second level of the hierarchy but still keeping in mind the country level which was the first one now we see the sales by country and state and once we hit the uh, the expand button once again, we go down to all of the cities in Europe where we sold our products. Once again, we drill up using exactly the same icon. We have also another icon which is called go to next level, but this one is not recommended since the geocoding uh, service will probably give back some errors. In this exercise, we can also have a look at the formatting options uh, for this kind of chart where we can change the theme to, for example, grayscale. The default one is the road, aerial, which is the satellite, dark and light, depending on our uh, needs. We can also have a look at the section of map controls where we can, for example, turn on zoom buttons that will appear in the top right corner of the chart that will allow the user uh, zoom in not only with scroll like I'm doing right now, but also with uh, some buttons on the map. The last formatting option is the category labels. We cannot turn on um, value labels, but we can turn on category labels and you will see that each of the country will get uh, automatically a label next to it.